ERA of 1.90 leads the country. Here's the 0-1 pitch. Swing and a line drive into right field. That's a base hit, and it'll get a run home. Spoon's over to get it. Turner's going to try for two. Spoon bobbles it. The throw to second base, and they got it. They throw to second base, and they get it. Turner to be played in this ballpark today after four were played yesterday and last night. There's a ground ball to deep short, and that's going to get through for a hit. Vinson took that one the other way. A two-strike hit for Matt. And the Austin from second, Ficacello from first. Swing and a line drive, base hit in the right field. Vinson will score. Ficacello moves over to third. A two-out hit from Spoon, and the ball game's tied at one. Three and two to Preston Overby. The payoff is on the way, and he struck him out. Got him with a breaking pitch out of the strike zone. Overby chased it. The right-hander deals a 1-1, and McAfee hits it to the second baseman. Bobbled there by Overby. Picks it up and didn't get him at first base. The 1-0's on the way. Swing and a line drive to McAfee at short. That ends the inning. The 0-2's on the way, and a breaking pitch is grounded to the right side, and that's going to trickle through for a hit. To the left of the second baseman, Serrano just kind of poked that breaking ball off the end of the bat, up the middle. The runner starts, then stops, hit off the pitcher's glove. It caroms behind the mound, and nobody's going to be able to make a play. The runner gets his lead from first. The pitch is coming. Double play ball is short. McAfee to Ferris to Ficacello, and that gets him out of the inning. Six to four to three. Aston faces the minimum in the fourth. Aston's ready to pitch. The one-two's coming, and he got him with a breaking ball. A swing and a miss. Barrett's ready, and here comes the payoff pitch. Swing and a miss. Got him with a slider. Overby strikes out for the second time, and Ole Miss goes in order for the third time. Pitch is coming, and Serrano rips it off the glove of the third baseman. Serrano's going to reach. Mistoni should have caught it. Vincent waits on another. Here it comes, swinging a ground ball up the middle. That one's going to get through for a hit. Serrano around second. He's going to try to go to third. The throw over there is not in time. Serrano is safe. And the Aston checks. Now the 0-2's on the way. A breaking ball's grounded up the middle. Ferris fields it. He'll tag the runner for one. Throw to first double play. The Razorbacks turn their second inning ending double play. Not to contact pitcher this afternoon or this morning. There's a strikeout, though, as Helsel takes a fastball right down the pipe. It's with one out. The 2-2 swung on, line toward right center field. Overcomes the center fielder, Bossfield. He can't get it. It'll drop for a hit. Anderson rounds first, but he'll... Anderson gets his lead, not running. Breaking ball, swung on, line into right field. That's a base hit. Anderson's going to try to go to third. The throw over there is not going to be in time. They leads from second and third. The pitch is coming, and he hit it. He hit him with a 1-2 pitch, and the bases are going to be loaded. They're... The 1-1 one, one, swung on and grounded it off Mahan. It hits Mahan for the third out of the inning, and that was going to go into right field. Be five tomorrow. The 2-2's two, coming, swing and a comebacker. Nicely played by Beeks. He flips to first, and Mathis is out number one before it ended this morning. Here's the 0-1. Anderson hits it toward the hole. It's short. Tough chance for McAfee. Goes to second. They get the force, and that's it. And we are going to have an argument. Mike, two outs in the inning. Beeks with a 1-2 pitch. Swing and a miss. He struck him out on a slider. He's got Jamison set up. A ball and two strikes. The pitch is on the way, and it's a called strike three. Threw him a fast ball. Jamison took it, and that ends the inning. Down all across the country. Here's the 2-0 pitch. Swung on and skied into center. That ball's hit well. Bosfield going back. That one is going to be over his head, and it'll bounce over the wall for a ground rule double. Well, Anderson put a charge into that one. Here it comes. Ficacello swings and loops it out into right field. That ball's going to get down for a base hit. They're going to hold Anderson at third. They hold Anderson at third. They had to wait to see if that ball would be caught. Push the runner. So strategically, this is a wise move by Ole Miss. Fisher could win it now. Ole Miss will move. Everybody back around the infield except the third baseman, and there's a wild pitch! A wild pitch! Anderson scores, and Arkansas wins! The Hogs win it on a wild pitch in the bottom of the 10th inning.
He threw an off-speed delivery to Fisher in the dirt. It got by the catcher for a wild pitch, and that's how the Hogs win it.